Hey y'all, welcome back to Yellow Texas where we are in the tropics of Hawaii. Okay, I'm kidding. We are in Nevada, Texas where we're in Memorial Park about to play disc golf. Let's do it. But before we got started, we needed a lesson first. Britt, thank you so much for having us out here. We are in Memorial Park for the first time. We've been to Uvalde plenty, but this is our first time being out here, and we heard that disc golf is becoming very popular, and uh, I've done it a couple of times, but I hear you're the man to talk to as far as getting some key points and actually being successful out on the golf course. Well, I don't know how <laughs> successful you're gonna be, but uh, they say it's like starting a lawnmower. Oh. It's that torque, it's through, it's through your chest rather than just flicking a disc in the yard. Okay. I haven't exactly mastered that, and I've been doing this for <laughs> over 20 years. And so. I've only mowed the grass a couple of times yeah. in my life, too. So. But yeah, no, that, that's more the idea, just a, a pull through. All right. Got it. Memorial Park is also Uvalde's main attraction for family outings, fitted with a playground, skate park, walking trails, and resting areas with plenty of shade for a picnic. You know, one of the things I love about Uvalde is that there's never a shortage of outdoor activities. And since we got warmed up on the disc golf course, we're gonna drop the disc and we're gonna golf on the course. Uvalde Memorial Golf Course is a picturesque 18-hole open golf course with excellent fairways and great hospitality. <laughs> See it? <laughs> you got the grass that time. Jeez. It went up. It's the perfect course that lets you escape and has everything you need to improve your game. Now you won't get the whole Uvalde experience without a trip to El Progreso Memorial Library. This library isn't your usual study with books and novels. There's more to the narrative than what meets the eye. Oh, it's a great story. Back in 1903, a group of very foresighted women gathered together to form an association where they would have self-improvement, civic improvement and to establish a public library. But it's more than just a library, I like to say, because uh, in addition to the traditional library services, we do have a museum. Okay. We have a bookstore in conjunction with the museum. Okay. We have a local history room, an 11 county archival deposit. Wow. So we are, I like to say, a civic and cultural center. We've got resources of all kinds and materials, uh, the building, it's a unique treasure in Uvalde. You know, of all the places you can visit here in Texas, Uvalde has got to be my favorite spot. You can have tons of fun right here on the square, including the Grand Opera House. And you can go outdoors. There's plenty to do, especially on the river. And of course, there's shopping, tons of history that make Texas what it is. So pack up your car and get out here and see Uvalde for yourself. For detailed information on all the places we visited today, go to visituvaldi.com. <laughs>